Ella Clark, your name. Savia. Was it an X or an S? <clears throat> I told you before, but you just don't remember me. I remember you, though. You were also known as Snakeskin. Now, Xavier, will you give a, an account of this court of the precise offense that led up to your arrest, huh? Well, my, uh, my guitar was in hot down at the South Rampart Street uh, pawn shop. It was on display in the, uh, in the loan shark's window. And, uh, you know, it's my life's companion. And... Are you drunk? No. Just... I'm tired. You want to rest for six weeks in the house of detention? No, sir. I don't want to do that. My uh, guitar was in hot, and, uh, and uh, it was the first time in my life. And, uh, uh, you know, it gave me a real bad feeling. And uh, I, I can't explain it to you, but everybody has something that's very important to them. With me, it's my guitar. And, uh, you know, it was a, a, a gift from a very, uh, a very great man, Leadbelly. I ain't asking no questions about your guitar. What happened the night before the party was raided? Well, I had to find some way to, you know, get my guitar out of hot. So, uh, I ran into uh, Charlie Five. Charlie who? Uh, this, well, his name is, uh, Sank. Charlie Sank, but they call him Charlie Five because Sank means five in French, and you can hit on him for five bucks if you really need it. And uh, so he came up to me and approached me in the Starlight uh, Lounge. It was uh, about six o'clock that day, in the p.m. And uh, he came up and approached me and uh, offered me the job. What job? I thought you already know about the job. You know, the court could hear you better if you'd hold your head up when you talk. I am. What did he ask you to do? He asked me to, uh... Well, he wanted me to entertain at this party, and I told him my guitar's in hock. He says, it doesn't matter. You don't need your guitar. And, uh... He says, all you gotta do is just, you know, be part of this you know, party. Mm. He offered to pay you for taking part in this party which was raided tonight in the premises of Bourbon Street over the club rendezvous, huh? Is that it? Yeah. And you started this disturbance at this party, huh? Yes, sir, I did. I just, I, I was fed up, I got disgusted, I was sick, and uh, I felt like my whole life was uh, something sick on my stomach, and I just had to throw it up. So I threw it up. And uh, I started to bust up the joint. You smashed up the place? Well, Snakeskin, if I let you go, how soon can I expect you back here again? Oh, I'm never coming here again. I'll never be down here again, Your Honor. Uh, it's about time for the, uh, the pawn shop to open there on South Rampart Street, and I'm going down there and get my guitar out of hock, and I'm going to split out of the city and, and uh, you know, for good. And all that. You know, a bunch, all the people that know me or thought they'd known me, never gonna see me again. And, uh, well, and I'm, uh, I'm all through those parties, too. And that's the truth. That's the truth. <laughs>